Welcome everyone and thank you for joining us to look at debunking some of the most popular urban myths about coffee and health. I see many patients on a daily basis who often ask about coffee and its impact on their health. It's incredible to see how widespread the myths about coffee are, how many people believe them and how often they're reported in the media. Heart disease is one of the largest health issues affecting the UK and the scientific evidence shows that moderate quantities of caffeine don't significantly affect people's risk of coronary heart disease, their risk of stroke or have any effect on blood pressure. This evidence is supported by the recommendations of the UK British Heart Foundation who also highlight that coffee drinking should not increase your risk of developing these conditions either. Similarly, with coffee drinking and your risk of developing cancer, there's a large amount of scientific data showing that when factors such as smoking are removed, moderate coffee consumption is not associated with any increased risk of cancers, and that includes breast, kidney, bladder, pancreas, ovaries, colon or rectal cancers. So again, the message is one of moderation. Moderate consumption of coffee, which is about four to five cups per day, is safe and may be associated with some health benefits. However, if you're pregnant, then you should be mindful of the recommendations of the Food Standards Agency and limit your intake of caffeine to a total of 200 milligrams per day from all sources, and that includes tea, coffee, cola, and chocolate. I hope you've enjoyed this short film and feel reassured that you really can relax and enjoy your coffee. See you again soon.